Good morning, guys. I have been stuck under this dog, and I'm right up against uh, this. Ah, uh, nipple. <laughs> Is he nipping you? This one likes to hug the bed. <sighs> so we've just been saying that Molly's probably really missing Lucas, but he's also really liking Lucas being gone because then he gets to like not get jumped on or anything like that. <sighs> And he gets to sleep in our bed. Well, wake up in our bed. All by himself without getting jumped on. Don't you, Molly? But it's like 10 o'clock. This has not happened in a long time. I haven't even woke up this time hungover before. No. This is like the first time in a long time that I've actually woken up this time. Yeah, but we didn't get to... Bed. Yeah, we didn't get to bed till like 12. I think it's half a level when I say that. So... Okay, though. But what I think we're going to do, because it's so late, there's really no point having breakfast because then we'll not want dinner. So I think we should get ready and then take Molly for a walk. And go and get some dinner. Brunch. Do you want that, Molly? Nobody gets excited. Do you go for a walk? I think he's walk. thinking. Dad, it's too early. Like, I'm gonna go for a walk. Where's your leader? Where's your leader? I can feel him like just sitting still. Ow. Where's your leader, Molly? Do you go for a walk? Do you go for a walk? Do you go for a walk? Yeah, you wanna go for a walkies? Do you go for a walk? Get some breakfast, down. That's exactly what he's doing last night, but on a like a tiny scale. <laughs> and he was like running at you. And yeah. just, <laughs> Did you see all the slaver bounce there? Come on, bring it in. Come on. Come on. Look at my big floppy ears. Oh, you like to come to your mummy, don't you? Because you're a good boy. I'm not touching it. I've got gloves on. Oh. Hey. Crossbar. Crossbar challenge. Yeah. Missed. Nothing about that was going to hit the crossbar. Hmm. Are you bringing it in, Miles, or is your wee pole there? That's why he likes to smell. Now, if he rolls in something, he's going to get wrong. Because it's normally poo. He's going for an next block. Day seven. What, what, what day is it today of Christmas? I don't know, ten. Is it? Is it ten today? I don't know. I'm not awake, so I don't know the day. Day ninth. In the Morton household. Molly is out in his natural habitat on a green field sniffing while the blue superman is going to hurt somebody. Oh, oh, oh that could have been so good if you caught it. Molly! No. It's stupid. Hi guys. Do you need... Yeah. Look at who we've got. I'll do it, I'll do it, come here. I'll do it, yeah. Bye. Let Daddy do it. So, me and Alex have had a proper chilled out day. Have we even vlogged since um, taking Molly for a walk? No. Yeah. Oopsie geezies, oopsie daisies, guys. <laughs> so, we literally well, went to the shop, got some bacon, up. made ourselves a bacon sandwich. I made you a bacon sandwich. Well, oh, Alex made us a bacon sandwich. And I sat on The Sims all day, Before and I Alex sat on Assassin's Creed. After I did the vlog. Oh, he's making a point that he did it today. Just saying. I've done it every single day since doing it, but Alex will make sure that you know about it. So, we've been to me mum's, we've picked up Lucas. Have you had a nice time? Yeah. Molly's just fell down the stairs. Molly. Careful because it'll be hot. Molly. So we're going to have a nice bath. Get nice and clean. And I'm going to go back on the sim so we'll see what happens next. In a, in a funny shape. Santa's beard wasn't sure about that. No thanks Granny. I'll ask somebody else. And off he flew straight on to... 
Oh, other way. Other way. A princess in a castle. Hello, princess. Can I be your beard? Asked Santa's beard. You are a beautiful beard, said the princess. But I'm beautiful enough already. I see what you mean. I'll ask somebody else, said Santa's beard. And off he flew straight on to... A pirate. A pirate on a creaky ship. Hello pirate, can I be your beard? Asked Santa's beard. Arr! I've already got a beard, thanks, said the pirate. <laughs> Quite right, said Santa's beard. I feel a bit seasick anyway. Santa's beard flew off over the waves. Oh. Over the islands and fishing boats for miles and miles past all kinds of creatures. Not one of them wanted a beard. Does the whale want a beard? No. Does the sea lion want a beard? Does the squid want a beard? Does the seagull want a beard? Does the arctic fox want a beard? Does the polar bear want a beard? After a very long time, the sea turned into ice and snow started to fall. A little red lump shone in the whiteness far below. That looks comfy. I could do with the rest, said Santa's beard. To no one at all. Nobody needs me, he shouted as he fell through the night. This a bear. Is that a polar bear? Yes, he back. And he landed with a whomp. Ow! Who's that bashing me on the bottom? said the red lump. I'm Santa's beard. I'm cold and lonely and nobody needs me, said Santa's beard. Oh, I think oh. that My lovely beard! I'm so no. glad you're back. Oops. Oops. Come on. <laughs> his beard goes there from his ear to his other ear. I'm so glad you're back, said Santa. My face is freezing. Will you keep the wind off my chin while I deliver all these presents? I'd love to, said Santa's beard. I think a beard really suits you, said the polar bear. Happy Christmas. The end. And he goes back onto Santa's face. Right guys, so tonight it's been me left all alone for the past 10 million hours. Alex is wearing the bed. It is technically now tomorrow. So I've been playing on The Sims all night. And then I got addicted and then I didn't want to come off. So I'm going to go to bed now. So I'm going to say goodnight.